a few jobs for dogs out there. Some of you might remember Lassie, who had her own movies and TV show. So now meet Coco. He also got to be the star of a movie, Red Dog. Let's chat to Lukura, his trainer, to see what it took to turn Coco into a movie star dog. Coco actually has been an, an amazing dog, really, right from start. Um, normally, I allow a dog, for example, to settle in for a couple of days before I even sort of do much with him. But with Coco, I was actually able to take him out the, the first day and start actually teaching him stuff. Look left. Stay. Good boy. Stay. Good. He started picking up a lot of the exercises as quick as any six, seven month old pup, which I find amazing. Crawl, crawl, good boy, crawl. Oh, stay down, stop, good boy. He has grasped up to, up to about 30 different commands. This, this is an amazing script. This is absolutely fantastic. When I first read it, I thought, what an extraordinary dog. Now, this dog had a way of communicating with people and it was absolutely extraordinary in his own way. Good boy. You don't often get these types of projects with a dog starring uh, as, as Red Dog. To know that it's actually based on a true story of a dog that actually existed uh, is even more special. I think one of the things that's special about him is that he's learned how to communicate. You can see him sometimes just sitting there listening and actually works things out. And, uh, and to me, that's the type of dog that Red Dog was. You can see often just when you start to read the book, you start to re understand here's a dog that actually really looked and glared and, and started to work things out with humans. All those tricks he had to learn. Wow, he really did pull it off. What a star.